Notre Dame women's soccer team opens up the regular season this Friday versus Wisconsin as the defending national champions. And I got a chance to speak with head coach Randy Waldrum about expectations for the Irish this year. Expectations are high, and, 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 but we put those expectations on our own selves. So, um, you know, that's just kind of normal around here. I, I think um, the teams, you know, we've had some ups and downs with the preseason. I mean, it's given us a chance to look at a lot of our young kids. And, um, you know, the freshmen have looked great. I think one of the things the fans can look forward to is I think we're going to have the ability to score some goals. We look very good offensively in both the preseason games against two really good teams. And despite giving up five goals in a win against Virginia, Coach Waldrum really likes how the young defense is coming together. Now, I like the, the talent that we have. I think Taylor Snyder has stepped in and done a great job there. Uh, Jasmine Halls, you know, finally got over some injuries she had last fall, so she should be ready to step into that back line. And I think Sammy Schofield, uh, another one of our freshmen, can play back there if we need her to play there. So I think it's going to be a good defense, but I think it's just going to take a little bit of time to get it all together. One area to keep an eye on is in the net, where the Irish graduated goalie Nikki Weiss. Juniors Maddie Fox and freshman Sarah Voigt and Jim Jasper all could see playing time. Well, I think it's an open race, and the reason I say that is, um, you know, Maddie has backed up Nikki the last couple of years, but, but Nikki really was the goalkeeper that handled, you know, our stretch runs and our big games for us. And so even though Maddie's going into her junior year, she's really not had a, a lot of big games under her belt. So I think the, um, uh, the job is wide open. And of course, the team's strengths remain in their offensive abilities. Our speed and athleticism is very good. When you look at us physically, that's that part I like about our team. Uh, and then I think in terms of the soccer ability, I think the attacking uh, mindset and mentality that we have is, is probably the strength of our team right now. The team will play a tough schedule with seven of the first 11 games on the road. It's, it's a great non-conference schedule. We, we like to play top teams. We bit off a little bit more this year maybe than we have in the past, but um, we wanted to get a measuring stick where we were going to be. So we thought we needed that test early and uh, get exposed by some good teams. You know, you hope you get wins, but if you don't, you, we know you're going to get exposed. So we won't go into the Big East Conference thinking we're better than we really are. Going into Friday's contest, Coach Waldrum is looking for the team to maintain offensive control and execute defensively. We want us offensively to be a better, uh, a better team at keeping possession of the ball. That's kind of been one big focus of ours uh, offensively is we're, we're good at attacking, but sometimes we, we attack so much so fast we don't have patience and keep the ball. So we've been working on that. Uh, defensively, you know, we're always looking to shut teams out and try to... Uh, uh, to do that job defensively. With a tremendous set of talent, the big picture remains the same for the Fighting Irish. The talent is there, you know, now do, can we stay healthy enough? Can we put enough of the uh, pieces together and, and have the ball bounce the right way at key times of the year? You know, we'll see, but, but in terms of talent and what we have, I think there's enough talent there to make another good run at this thing, and it's, it, there's enough talent here to win it. You know, if we can have some other things fall into place and if we can keep getting better. Remember, Irish fans, you can catch every goal and the rest of the game right here live on UND.com starting at 5.30 p.m. For UND.com, I'm Ryan Camden.